Welcome to today's video. Today we're going to discuss Harley Davidson, its factory warranty, and how the parts you choose to put on it could affect it. All right, let's start with what voids that factory warranty. And a better way of wording that is what affects that factory warranty. EPA regulates Harley Davidson as a motor company as to the performance and the emissions of their motorcycles. They have to operate within a certain standard. That's why you may have heard rumors of different tuners that they could no longer use and they had to send back or fines if they used them. That's where that comes from. EPA regulates what they can do as a motor company and that is gonna directly affect your warranty. So essentially, Harley-Davidson can only warranty an engine which stays within that EPA standard. Unfortunately, most aftermarket parts don't keep your bike within that EPA standard. You buy a brand new motorcycle, it's got a two year warranty and you slap some crazy rad exhaust on it, it's gonna give it this outrageous performance. That performance, my friends, comes at a cost. What's happening is you're taking your bike from being a street motorcycle to a track motorcycle, from a, a daily driving vehicle to what the government or EPA would consider a race applicated motorcycle. At that point, your factory warranty could be affected. It does not mean your warranty is void. It means anything that is tied to that engine as a problem that could have been affected by that aftermarket or race part you put on it could essentially affect your warranty and its coverage. And that's just a decision you have to make. Is that extreme crazy performance rad part worth giving up the warranty uh, for the smile on your face? Now you want the most performance, but you want to stay within your warranty. You want to stay EPA. Well, that's where Screamin' Eagle comes into play. Screamin' Eagle is Harley Davidson's line of performance parts. They spend a lot of money and a lot of time researching how to get the best performance while staying within that EPA range. And that, my friends, allows them to make sure you're covered on your warranty. Still a lot of questions out there and a lot of comments about, well, what if I get the Screamin' Eagle parts and I put them on after 60 days or after 90 days, is it then warranted or, or it still affects the warranty? Let me break it down for you like this. So your factory warranty covers parts and labor of your drivetrain and many other parts of your motorcycle. If within the first 60 days you install Screamin' Eagle parts, they will then be attached to that two year warranty. Here's a very interesting fact. If you actually extend this warranty for up to five years, you can still attach those Screaming Eagle performance parts to that warranty that will be covered for the entire five years. Now, let's say you've owned your motorcycle for six months and then you decide to buy some Screamin' Eagle parts. What happens then is your Screamin' Eagle parts come with a one year warranty. So you've got, you've got a year and a half left on your factory warranty. That does not change even though you installed these Screamin' Eagle parts at six months. You still have that year and a half left. The difference is these new Screamin' Eagle parts you bought come with their one year parts warranty. Now, you've got your one year warranty. You've got 1.5 years left on your two year warranty. So, when that one year warranty on parts, those Screaming Eagle performance parts is up, you will still have six months left of your factory warranty on the rest of your engine and your motorcycle. Keep in mind, this Screaming Eagle parts one year warranty is not service related. So to recap, you can get up to a five year warranty on your brand new motorcycle. And if in the beginning you purchase Screaming Eagle performance parts on that, they will be included for the entire five years. One of the cool things about that is you can also work those that purchase price into your financing a lot of times. If during that five years you decide to one year in purchase those Screaming Eagle performance parts, you now have a one year period be inside that five year mark that those parts are covered, but not the service, that's only the parts are covered. 
the rest of your five-year warranty is not affected. So obviously getting those parts in the beginning is a huge advantage, but if you just can't do it, it doesn't affect your long-term warranty. It only affects those parts and uh, you still get the one-year warranty on the parts. That's a little bit of confusion cleared up, I hope, for a lot of you as to why the Harley-Davidson warranty is the way it is and how it works when getting those performance Screaming Eagle parts.